my name is Ashley Weisong and I'm a board certified dermatologist. I'm also certified by the American Board of Venal Lymphatic Medicine. I wanted to talk to you a little bit about venous insufficiency and treatment for varicose veins. So venous insufficiency is actually extremely common. Um, it's found in up to 55% of women as well as 45% of men. A lot of people are at risk for several reasons. Prolonged standing or sitting during the job, um, being female puts you at higher risk. Um, having multiple children or multiple pregnancies, and particularly having a family history, having a mother or a father with venous insufficiency. And so what is venous insufficiency? It's essentially the inability of the blood to return in an effective manner from the legs back up to the heart. And so rather than the blood returning efficiently, it actually flushes backward down the legs, the veins get lar enlarged, and then essentially the best way to think about it is the body tries to find all these other ways to get that blood back up to the heart and creates a lot of incompetent veins called varicose veins. And in addition to being unsightly, these can become very uncomfortable and can lead to skin changes as well as ulceration, which is really end stage and something that we want to avoid. Uh, there are now unbelievable therapies that we can use minimally invasively under local anesthesia in an outpatient office to shut down these insufficient varicose veins in a safe and effective manner for you. Please see your board certified dermatologist or your ASDS member to understand the latest and greatest in varicose vein treatment.